For those of you who like to learn things via flashcards, uh, I like to typically use the Anki app. It's really useful when it comes to spaced repetition and just, you know, learning stuff. So flashcards are pretty cool. How can we do that in the terminal? That's always the question with anything that we do nowadays is how can we do it in a terminal? Well, I was watching this video on YouTube um, by this, I guess a, some doctor or somebody in the medical field uh, does a lot of stuff with Linux, but the, the guy has not even been active, I think in like three years, but I saw this video where he talks about this um, bash script that he wrote right here um, that basically will let you do like flashcards in your terminal. So I copied it because it wasn't like on GitHub or anything easy, so I just copied it. I don't know what a lot of this is doing, haha. -ha. Um, but I did add some stuff to it. So all of this is like the main script. This is what does, like it puts out all the output, which is uh, a tab separated CSV file that has um, three columns of content, category, and then question and then answer. And I added a bunch of tests to just like, you know, if you, if you grab this script from my GitHub, which it is on there now, um, if you grab it and run the script and it doesn't find the directory or the file, it will make it for you if you want it to, it, it'll give you an option. But it's basically just like flow control to say like, hey, you don't have the directory, do you want me to make the directory? And if you don't have the directory, you obviously don't have the file. Um, so it will make the directory and then make the file in it. And if you have the directory and not the file, it'll ask you if you just want it to make the file. Um, but after, after that, um, the usage of it is fairly simple. Um, I have a, oh, not config. So I have a CSV with some tab separated values, and then I can just type flash and it will show you a line, the category, and the question. What's two plus two? It's obviously five. Um, and then it, do, it does the shuff command, so shuffle, and it'll shuffle up the answers. Um, so, I mean, it, there's not a lot of them in here, so it's pulling out the same one a couple times. But you can see I got several, um, I only got three questions, so it's gonna pick a lot of the same ones at the same time. But if you have a lot of cards, It'll shuffle through them, and it'll just show it to you randomly. I mean, it's not like the like the weighted system that Anki has, where it will um, take the ones that you rate as a specific um, level of diff excuse me difficulty, and then do those more often until you learn it. This is just a very simple way of doing flashcards in your terminal. Um, to make it any more complicated is to pull out your hair because you're going to have to write it in Bash. Um, I know there's plenty of programs out there that do it, but the reason I did this is because I just wanted something simple, something that would work, and it's just a very small manipulation of plain text. And there's not a lot of overhead with it. It's just, you got a directory, you got a CSV with some tab separated values, three values per line item, you run a script and it shuffles them and you just answer questions. So it's a quick and dirty, easy way of doing some plain text flashcards in your terminal and it's on github on mine um it's on here under um it's one of my newer repos i just made it this month uh flash flash dot sh so it's in here um that's it yeah you can just download this repo or just grab the script um, and then run it. Just add it to uh, an executable file like uh, local bin and run the script and then it'll make your uh, directory and deck file for you if you want it to and then you just fill it up or you could just um, take a CSV that you have of those three columns and then rename it deck.csv, throw it in the directory and you're good to go. And then you can do some flashcards. So. Have fun if you like it and you use it, let me know. And yeah, have fun.